Is there anything I can do for you, champ? Gee willikers, Mr. K. I think we have everything we need. Okay. Did we learn anything? I learned you need to shoot a new video. Yeah, well, you know, we're working with what we got. Eli. YCI helps us share the message of Jesus with our friends. Okay, but how? Well, it starts with us. All it takes to launch a club is a few friends. Then we need a teacher to let us use their room, and a mature adult to help us reach the campus. You mean a random adult like this? No. A campus mentor is usually a youth pastor or a member of a local church who's already background checked by both YCI and the school district. We're the ones leading the club, and they're just here to help. After all that's squared away, we'll need to get approval from school administration. Every school works a little differently, but usually a simple email or a simple conversation will work. We could meet in the classroom, or we could meet in the library, or we could even meet in, in the gym. Anywhere works really as long as the space is available at a consistent day and time each week. Then, it's just a matter of letting people know the club is happening. Inviting people in the halls. Handing out invite cards. And getting on the announcements. Stuff like that. Ladies and gentlemen, starting today, join us for our brand new YCI club. Sounds easy enough. What do we actually do during these club meetings? Well, according to the video, we play, pray, grow, and go. Yeah. Right, but what does that actually mean? Well, first we play a game together. If the club is fun, it would be way easier to invite new people. Playing together is pretty fun, but praying together is pretty self-explanatory, I think. It's just praying for your school and your club. Growing together is all about studying the Bible. YCI has a weekly curriculum that can provide us with game ideas, prayer points, and devotionals that can help us with what our friends are going through and connecting them with God's Word. Hmm, okay. So what about uh, going? Well, going is all about sharing the gospel outside of your club as well as finding ways to serve the community. A way of serving your community could be providing breakfast to your teachers or creating care packages for people in need. That's for the teachers. Why not just call it serving then? Hmm, because then it wouldn't rhyme. Great, when's our first club meeting? Right now. <laughs>